And Gucci, you you you're one of our fellas that it felt like it was gonna get away from you for a minute. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You 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 get locked up, you go away for a little bit. At any point, do you think that you can come back and capture your throne, or do you feel? Did you ever feel like, man, the music business is so fickle? Anytime I'm away, could be a problem. Well, you know, when you locked up, the first thing you think about is your freedom. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But I was so passionate about, you know, succeeding. And um, I had so much of my life wrapped up in being, you know, an entertainer. That was my livelihood. I was thinking about, damn, you know, when I get out, am I going to still be able to, you know, continue my job and at the same level I was? But mm -hmm. It always worked out. Yeah, we seen Meek just recently come home. Yes. And, and it appears with Meek, too, just with the championships and the way that, you know, it, people are really checking for him. I, I got a chance to not compare it to how you came home, but that we we ready to continue to embrace those that we, for whatever time we lost them, it's like, okay, they home and let, let's make sure. As long as the product is good, too. You yeah, know, we're not giving growing. away charity. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. But did you feel the same way when, when, when Meek came home? Like I'm, there's work to do? To I feel like people don't miss you till you're gone. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like people didn't really, before Meek was gone, people went rocking with him like the way they mm -hmm. is now. That's true. And then like with me, people forget. Like I don't forget. People didn't celebrate me before I got out. Right. It wasn't like people were like, I love Gucci. You know what I'm saying? He the one, you know. But everybody like a comeback story, and I'm glad that people like me and celebrate me now. But before I went through that, people was like, I was blackballed for a long time before mm -hmm. I had success. So I, it was a climb. It's like even now coming back and people like, oh, we love Gucci now. It's still kind of different for me. So right. our story is kind of the same, and at the same time, it's kind of different. Yeah, because you know Meek had said it also, man, where pretty much the same, where he was like, man, he said, uh, you know, he was hearing things, mm -hmm. and, you know, there were certain people that didn't, that didn't rock with him. And, and you do take notice of that. Yes. You do take notice of that. Yes. Why do you think you were blackballed at that time? I was blackballed early in my career because uh, I just had beats with rappers who was probably more popular than mm -hmm. me. So a lot of people was like choosing sides and choosing affiliations. They'd be like, I like Gucci, I like his music, but I'm not going to work with him because right, yeah. if I work with him, maybe this other artist might not work with me. Right. And you know, I, I, you know I, didn't, I didn't respect it, but I understood it. And mm -hmm. you feel like all that's gone now? Oh, it came full circle. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Gucci, do you ever look back at some of the like the old pictures? Like you have really maintained like the weight and everything, man. Do you ever look at some of the old pictures? Yeah. I post them. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Post Celebrate them. them. Yeah, Throw man. Up. What was your biggest as far as when you and weight? Like three hundred. Damn. What are you right now? Like two hundred eight. I heard that, man. So what do you, what do you do to keep to keep the weight off? I just eat right and work out every day. I heard that. That's it. Yeah, that sounds that sounds, sounds, sounds so easy simple. When you put it like that. Yeah, yeah it just